Man, it's everything it's supposed to be. You know, um, first, grateful to Cowboy for taking the fight, maybe against his better judgment. Oh! I just see myself facing an insecure little lad swinging on a saddle with a pop gun and a feather in his hat. I'll be sending your geriatric ass fucking yeehawing back to the stables on Saturday. I do look fucking healthy. I look great. You look like you've served the last two terms in the fucking Oval Office. You look worn out. You look aged and withered. I focus on one thing and one thing only. I know I'm going to be a champion. He's number two. He's always been number two. I'm going to be number one. Oh. There's a difference between watching a man on the screen and watching him stand across from you. And there will be none of that respect upheld. I won't respect his space. I won't respect the air he's breathing. And I'm going to press and break him in the octagon. It's a completely different world now. Everything's changed. Hernandez near the end. That's it. Donald Cowboy Cerrone. I'm on the road to the throne. Oh, what you going to do better than me? Everything. You going to out-wrestle me? Everything. If we get in the octagon and I can throw no punches, no knees, Everything. no takedowns, no submission, I would kick your ass and just wrestle it flat out. Beat your ass in real life. Beat your ass on TV. Stop. Nigga, I'll beat your ass with some beef shit. Beat your ass on GP. Pull up on that sneak tip. Niggas run when they see me. Now your eyes fucking popping out when you seeing shit in 3D. Beat. When it come down to striking, I would knock you out flat out. To the white me, knock out all your white teeth. Warm fruit punch on your shirt for niggas thinking that I'm sweet. Paws loaded with concrete, fingertips with night quill. Quick to put a nigga right to sleep if he looking like he might squeal. Hands on deck, H O D, H O D. When I'm in this octagon, I'm G O D, G O D. Get that ass beat live. When it comes down to grappling, I will break your arm flat out. Bring There's that, nothing you can bring beat that me energy. in. I'm March second, bring than that you, energy. I'm stronger than you, and I promise you, if you come at less than hundred percent, March second, bring that energy. You would think about, you would reconsider fighting every bring that day energy. of your life. I the judges score the contest, fifty forty four. 50-44 and 50-45 for the winner by unanimous decision and new! How you gonna beat me? Domination, his head bouncing off the canvas. All his pony talk is gonna be fucking put on blast October 6th. Came back for the love of this, to come and shut this man up. A little rat, a little weasel. He's a glass jaw. The Chechens, the che my Chechen friends, the Vainaki soldiers, they told me that they have chicken jaws in Dagestan. And I believe them because I know a glass jaw when I see one. And I've seen this man wobble many times. I've seen his brother sparked unconscious in another promotion. I know he is afraid of a smack. And if you're afraid of a smack off me, a smack will feel like a double barrel shotgun. You hold on to legs for dear life. That's how you fight. You talk chicken this, chicken that, you shit your, you shit your jokes when shit hit, came on top. But you actually fight like a little shitty jokes rat. Anyway, you die for the legs and hold on to them for dear life. What kind of, what kind of fighting is that? What kind of man, what kind of, what kind of way of, of, of fighting is that? But this man is a glass jaw bomb and I'm gonna shatter him. Your little fake belt over there, you'll be a guy, a, a number 11 ranked, a, a real estate agent. And you, you, you bring that belt up on, on stage like, like it's a real belt. You're a phony, a fake, and I'm going to expose you. Now you're up on the real shit, kid. You're with the real dogs now, bro, brother, yeah? And you're going to be smoked October 6th. Thanks, God. I don't give a fuck what he's going to try and do. He's going he's to be swinging wildly like he is, sloppy, shooting for the legs. He's an amateur. He's a 20... Would you believe he's 26 and 0? I've never met a tw an, unbeaten, an unbeaten amateur in, in the professional game. I mean, he's fucking for nobody. Absolutely nobody. Anyone that he's half for has been decisions. He's in over his head. I'm going to pick him apart and bully him in there. Oh! That's the point! And that's the problem with takedowns is they gain the respect of the strike man up from the overhand. He goes back and forth, and that's what's made him out the mat off the best. Landing from Nurmagomedov, who came into this fight unquestionably in the best shape of his life. Connor's talking to him. I can't hear what he's saying, but he's getting tagged. Oh, that's Khabib talking, and he's, he's not saying nice things. Oh! 15 minutes in the books. We head to the championship rounds. 
Grabbing. Yes, sir. Good need to be to say that. McGregor forced to just cover up. How here, this is what's terrifying. Look at this right hand. Boom. Clips him on the chin. Trip by. Good entry by Nermago. Man, advantage. And He's got it. It's under the net. There it is. There's the tap. Choke. If you look at it, he's not even under the chin. And Connor forced the tap. And Khabib's still furious. Khabib's getting up. He's screaming at Pete's oh, And no, now Khabib no, jumps no, the no, fence. No, no, no. Whoa. No. 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 And he's going right at Dylan Denham. Take after the fight. Oh. Oh, geez. He's not. 